Okay, if I had to say one final thing, it's a definitely I would recommend branch out into others, like I said, it's broaden your horizons, expand your interests. But also, if I was to say, if we had to give a message to the Bionicle community who right now, you know, some of them are probably, most of them are probably very upset about all this, very lost, don't really know what to do. We've kind of been through this before. Yeah. We have a little bit of experience with the cancellation <laughs> of Bionicle. Um, TTV was actually formed after Bionicle was canceled. We kind of rose from the ashes a little bit. So yeah. uh, here's what I would say. We literally say. started like a month before they canceled it and then like went into like as IBZP and then went into TTV like after it was canceled. So yeah. Yeah. Here's what I'll say and I'll try not to take too long because we really got to wrap up in a minute here. But when G1 was canceled way back when, people were always trying to figure out, like, what kind of message, what kind of moral should we take from all this, and what, as Bionicle fans, should we do? And eventually, people kind of agreed, the best route to go is to devote all our time into making creative works, doing our mocks, doing our stories, artwork, videos, etc., etc., in the hopes to show LEGO that the Bionicle community is still alive and kicking, so that it may be brought back one day, possibly, in the future. And that was kind of what people did for the, about four years uh, yes, after Bionicle ended. Yes, please keep doing you know? mocks. It gives me something to do, too. <laughs> yeah, what... And what do what? you know? Lego brought Bionicle back. Yep. And then they took it away <laughs> two years later. <laughs> so, should that same moral apply? Should you still try to constantly show Lego that Bionicle is, still has an active fan base? I don't know. But here's what I will tell you. Bionicle is about a lot more than anything Lego can really do at any given point. Bionicle is a creation of theirs that I think has a little bit more weight to it than a lot of their other themes. It's created a community unlike many things that I've ever seen or been a part of. Bionicle, to me, is about more than whatever wave of sets with gimmicky gear functions and masks is on store shelves at any given point. It's about a lot more than how many prophecies or Unity Duty Destiny name drops you can shove into any given 22-minute story episode. Bionicle, to me, is about the fandom. It always will be. That's the core of the theme. Bionicle is about people like, people like Christian Faber for instance, who worked on the theme for so many years and developed so many concepts and artwork for it and really shaped what it ended up being. It's about Greg Farshti, who spent so many years of his life not only writing the story, but also answering fan questions and about it. And still answering boards. questions about it. Still, to still this day. Still answering questions. It's about Merlin Mann and Ryder Wyndham, people who worked through so many different hurdles to try their hardest to give us a story to actually relate to and connect with. It's about the fan sites like BZ Power and BSO1, who for so many years have been a place for fans to go to interact and also learn more about their theme. It's about us, who've been here for so many years trying to give entertaining content for you guys, to inform you about stuff, to be a place for you to connect with Bionicle, and it is about you, the individual Me? who create yes, you, <laughs> and you, and you, and you, and you. It's about the mockists, it's about the artists, it's about the authors, it's about the content creators who take what Lego provides you and makes it into your own thing. That's the purpose of Lego. So no matter how many times Lego will drag Bionicle's corpse out of the gutter <laughs> that they've buried it in to try to shill products on shelves to boost their bottom line, no matter whether Bionicle's on shelves or not, you don't need to prove to Lego anything anymore. What you do for Bionicle is about your own passion and your own love for it. And as long as that exists, Bionicle is not gone. It will never go away. All right! You don't need for Lego to do anything anymore. And if I have my way about it, I'll say this on air, I do not want Bionicle to come back. I want Bionicle to stay as a community thing. Forever. Preach it! Because that's... The community understands it. The community Woo! loves it. Nothing you do is any less valid than anything LEGO does. That's the purpose of LEGO as a creation. Uh, so, Meso 27, hey, everybody. Yeah, Meso, you're going to have to censor me. But holy <laughs> Where did that come from? Oh, my God. <laughs> that was crazy. I've been bottling it in. Yeah. I've been bottling this in for a day. I told you guys the other night. I was like fuming. I was like, oh my gosh, <laughs> what a speech! That was. Jeez. I feel like I'm ready to ride in the Mordor now. Uh, yeah, man. <laughs> it is <laughs> not <laughs> this day. Right, well, there will I'm be a okay, day when the up. fan base will be gone. You know what? I, I appreciate that, Messo. Let's sign the Constitution now. <laughs>
That, I'm talked out. I can't talk. That, that, that we yeah. hold self-evident. No. I think that's a good I'm place just... to end it. That's definitely the message you guys should uh, leave here with. Um... Oh, I would broaden oh. your horizons. There's other stuff in the world besides Bionicle, also, but if you also, really also, like also, Bionicle, also. you can do yeah. it. Yourself. We aren't going anywhere. We're still going to do everything no. we're doing right now. We're obviously, we're branching out now. There's stuff. Obviously, that's just to keep everyone entertained. Keep in mind, the recaps are going to end as per usual. I review everything. <laughs> so you have that to look forward to as well. Get hyped. Oh. And we'll yeah. do our best to keep being a fixture, but, uh... Uh, and obviously, this doesn't necessarily mean that Bionicle content is being dropped either. Like, there's still plenty of Bionicle no. stuff to talk about right now. Um, and how for how long that will last, don't know. We'll, don't we'll know. keep we'll keep going <laughs> for as much as we can. I've been really enjoying stuff like the Brick Feed podcast. Yeah. it's been a breath of fresh air <laughs> for me. So I would recommend if you're feeling bad about stuff, give it a shot. You may be surprised what you're find and what you're into nowadays. Yeah. Now. I'm I'm moving from like the place I've grown up. <laughs> And like so, the night the night during the one came out it was like Thursday. We had a going away party because it's like me and like eight ever of my very like close friends. Yeah. So like I literally said goodbye to all my friends. And I came home and, and then, then as I did added freaking say goodbye to Bionicle, Bionicle too. Bionicle. I, I do. It's fairly poetic. I do have to say, yeah, I was thinking about this the other day when I was writing a post on the message boards. It's like Bionicle, the original Bionicle that I grew up with ended a while ago, um, but. Yeah. In just a couple days, I'm going to be off leaving the nest for the first time in my life. I'm going to university. And I do have to say that I, I, I have to thank Lego for letting me have a chance to relive my childhood for, like, one last time before I leave the, the house. And yeah. Yep. So. Yep. No, actually, the majority of us are probably going to be moving out pretty soon. So yeah. this is a... It's a symbolic Bionicle, way to send things off. If it had to happen, I'd Bionicle as a happen. force and as an entity is never going away. It's just phases come in and come out. And this one, mismanaged though it may be, was certainly fun while it was a thing. Yeah. So, to that, I can say at least thanks. Yeah. And you know what? Again, LEGO did do this for us. So, instead of trying to badger them for things, like obviously we want the instructions and what have you, but go oh, ahead yeah. and tweet them thank you. Say thanks for the last two two years, fifteen years, all of it. Yeah. Yep. 